Welcome to Rick's Tip of the Week. You know you can work a body part with several different exercises. For example, if you do seated cable pull in, you're working bicep. If you're doing pressing, you're working tricep along with chest. But you do have certain exercises you do for shoulders. You have pressing and you have side laterals and forward raises and rear delt raises and all that. But I never thought that maybe you didn't think of this at one time. If you do pull downs and you do them to the back, do them to the front too, but you do them to the back, they can work your rear delt. If you use this rope trick I'm gonna show you right now, you're gonna work your rear delt. So watch this. When doing pull downs for your back, you've got to keep a good posture just like he has here. And pull right to the top of the chest, right there. Stretch all the way up, you come right to the top of the chest. It also works the delt, it works the bicep, but it's basically a back exercise. Now another way to do these is to pull behind the neck, but pulling behind the neck can also hurt your rotator cuff. But for him it doesn't, it seems to work, and you can see it's really working the rear delt. Not only the back, but the rear delt. You should come down and flex the biceps. So you can do these great, if it hurts, then don't do them. But it's just another alternative to doing pull downs. And I've seen people do these, they don't even know what they're doing, not realizing if they're working, but you can see everything come into play. All right, here's another good rear delt exercise. With the rope, two hands, keep your arms high, pull to your upper chest, and you can see right here where it's working the rear delt. What a great exercise. Try incorporating this in your workout along with your other delt exercise and you'll see great results in the rear delt. It'll really pop it out the way you want to look. And that's my tip of the week to you. Stay tuned for more. It's RickDrayson.com. He is the equalizer, baby. See you next time.